Hello everybody. I was going to say good morning until I checked the time and realised it's uh, the afternoon. That um, morning has really flown. I have got some fantastic news regarding the BritishWarriorWithin.com first meeting. Uh, the first thing I'll get out of the way before I get to that news is um, there's going to be a change of venue I'm afraid. Uh, the reason for that is I phoned the venue to book the hall today and the most obnoxious nasty woman didn't want to know. I wasn't interested in because of uh, what we're trying to do, trying to save Britain. No thanks, she said. Well, we all know what the answer to her is. Fuck you. Let's hope the Muslims trash your pub. So, the good news. It's not good news, it's absolutely bloody fantastic news and um, I really hope that uh, what this guy is doing doesn't stop him from managing to get to us. If you know Graham Moore, you know exactly what he's doing, you know exactly the kind of bloke he is, and you also know he is probably the guy that could save Great Britain. It's not an exaggeration. You're probably thinking, then, well, why is he um, going to quite a small venue? To, to... It's because he cares. And he wants to get to as many people as he possibly can. I keep looking and my eyes are sort of going over there. But the camera's there, which is really odd. Um, let's put it in the middle. See if that makes any difference. Yeah, if you know Graham, you will not want to miss going to see him, meeting him and listening to him speak. If you don't know Graham, you really need to come and listen to him speak. What he is doing is going to change this country forever. Again, that's not an exaggeration. You need to listen to him to find out. You can listen to him on Facebook, on Motivate. That is M-O-T-I-V with the number 8. Or you can see his Facebook page, which is Graham Moore, which is M-O-O-R-E. And uh, see a guy in a suit staring back at you. And you'll know by what's on his Facebook page, whether it's him or not. But we have the most brilliant opportunity to listen to this guy in person with the passion that he's got. I didn't think anybody was as passionate about this as I was, but obviously I was wrong. There are probably plenty of people as passionate as I am. Uh, just don't get as angry as I do. <laughs> um, yeah, anyway, that is on the going to be on the 10th of September, and it is now going to be at the new Queen Victoria pub, and that is 42 Church Street, Milton Keynes. It's closer to me, it's closer to Graham, it's closer to London, and those of you um, who are a bit further up north, if you really want to see this guy, you won't mind travelling to get there. Um, the reason that Nuneaton didn't work out was simply because they got all English flags in their pub all over the place. And they didn't want to know as soon as I said what we wanted to do. Um, I don't know if they thought it was the EDL or something stupid like that. But, you know, she was such a rude woman, it was ridiculous. Sums up this country at the moment, where people don't want to do anything to upset the public, to upset, well, anybody, really. We, we can't say fuck all without upsetting somebody, and it's, it's just getting ridiculous. But I know some of the subjects that Graham will be covering will be the right to bear arms. He will be talking about that history that we will be relying on in doing these things. And I keep getting my finger over the camera, don't I? And he will be talking about how the Quran and the cult or ideology of Islam actually is genocide. It is 
It's almost a manual for genocide, I think is the best way of putting it. This guy is English through and through. And I say English because this guy is English through and through. Um, I know a lot of you people from England, Wales and Ireland, so you like everybody to say British because it doesn't leave you out. But you're as passionate about your part of Britain as, as we are about England. And it's not meant detrimentally to you because we will stand by you shoulder to shoulder to get this country right. And Graham is exactly the same. He, he believes all countries need to get themselves sorted out. But he worries about Wales, Scotland and Northern Ireland because they would be heading possibly to socialism, which we all know destroys every country it touches. So, instead of just listening to me, instead of not knowing exactly what's going on, you will know that you've got a fantastic guest speaker. Please come along. The function room only holds 100. It's a nice function room. It's not some shitty little hovel. Holds 100. So now I'll be looking to fill that. Because that's 100 seated. There may be, I don't know what their limit is fire restriction wise. I don't know whether they can have people standing or not. But this should make a difference because you are talking about literally the guy that could shape the direction this country goes in. And if you don't want to be there for that, then we might as well all give in now, really. But also, don't forget the meeting is about British Warrior Within getting organised and being able to have projects to help defend our communities in this country because the unrest is coming it's already started in places and we need to get people together and not try and survive as ones or just one family because that won't work because they will be mob handed they will be armed um, so we've got to get communities to come together in quite as big a groups as possible the liberals will get about them they can cope on their own. I'm not worried about them. They've shown total disdain for any common sense. Oh, my bloody hand keeps covering that over, for God's sake. Oh, sun must be coming out of it. It's gone a bit lighter. Right, I'm not going to prattle on on this video. I just, I can't get through to you how much, if you don't know him, you're probably thinking, well, who the hell's Graham Moore? I assure you, you look back in history and you look at people who have changed this country. You look what Winston Churchill did, although it's not great because he was a bit of a globalist as well. But the people who have stood up and protected this country. Let's say Richard the Lionheart, for instance. I'm sure somebody will say, yeah, well, he was a bastard and what have you. But, you know, he led the Crusades. And... Uh, or oh, some of them, somebody again will correct me. So please, have a look at what Graham's got to say on the internet and realise you need to get here. Because Motivate Radio, as they call themselves, um, will be there. Because, yeah, they do go out on the radio, but they video everything as well. And they will be there videoing. And it may be, if you want to, be seen on camera some of you may not maybe your chance to air your views what you want to say and get it out there on youtube perhaps you've never had that opportunity before so let's do it let's get this country saved i hope you like my new brighton and Ove Albion premier league shirt hope that hasn't put any of you off Especially Graham if he's into football because he's South London. He might be Palace. Well, I better shut up in case he is. So, please, come along. And I'll always ask because I've, I've booked the venue now. It's all done. It's booked. It's not, oh, well, am I going to book it? Um, I could always do with help with funding that because what they're going to want, they want a deposit on the day as well, which you get back as long as the room's not trashed. So I've got to find quite a bit of cash for that. You can always um, help me out on https colon 
forward slash forward slash paypal.me forward slash British Warrior Within. And I'd really appreciate you doing that. Or you can go to the British Warrior Within dot com site and use the donate button. There is also loads of products I'm putting on Facebook. They are to try and help funding. I make one one fifty maybe for funding out of them. Because believe me, I am not stitching people up. This is how much it costs to get things um, done individually, basically, you know, when you choose a, a style and, and what have you. You can go out and buy a plain T-shirt for probably three, four quid, but the minute you want something put on it, um, then that all changes. And I thank you for listening. Please like this video. Please subscribe to English World Awakener. Sound like wanker then, doesn't it? English World Awakener on my YouTube channel which you, if you're watching this on YouTube, you will find just underneath. And you'll also find details of my, the British Warrior Within, PayPal option. Thanks again, and I hope to see you on the 10th of September. It's 1 o'clock till 5 o'clock. There's a bar, you can have a drink, as long as you don't trust, trash the place, or get too leery, because that won't help any of us. So, if you don't, go well with drink either don't drink or don't come but i hope to see you there and i hope we can have a real passionate talk about things that where we actually really start to make a difference really start to do something but you need to listen to graham first because if graham's right then we still need to hold back and follow his lead so it's well worth coming along and having a listening and making up your own mind. Bye for now then, guys.